He says nationally, children are twice as likely to get hit by a car on Halloween more than any other day of the year. So they're urging everyone to be safe when enjoying holiday festivities and keep your head on a swivel. Watch out. Hey, what about that? As we see people get back to all of the parties and the fun, we're very concerned that it could result in deaths or serious injury to Oklahomans. Last year, two people were killed in Oklahoma on Halloween weekend due to car crashes with drivers under the influence. In all, 33 crashes reported. There were 11 people who were walking that were killed in uh, crashes here in Oklahoma in 2020. So again, can't reinforce enough the idea that if you're going out to a bar, if you're going to parties with friends, parking lots can become very dangerous. AAA says the highest percentage of impaired driving crashes are with drivers between the ages of 21 to 34. Trooper Eric Foster says the Oklahoma Highway Patrol deals with hot spots for impaired driving during the holiday weekend, including I-44 and I-35 inside the metro. When people think intoxicated driving or drunk driving, they think of alcohol. Mm -hmm. But more and more we're seeing that the situations are prescription medications and legal substances like THC. OHP will have DUI checkpoints throughout the state during the holiday weekend to keep everyone safe on the road. <laughs>